Here's a slightly harder applied triangle trig problem. Uh, it's a modification of a problem from our book. Um, we are in a building looking out of a window at a tower. And we know we are 400 feet away from the tower, and horizontal distance. And we calculate the angle of elevation of the top of the tower. And that's an important precise phrase. Angle of elevation means angle up measured from the horizontal. And so as we see the top of the tower, let's say we see this at, um, let's say, 28 degrees. And we also measure the angle of depression which always sounds to me like a sort of alternative country folk band of the bottom. And again, really, really important. That's measured from the horizontal. It's not measured. It's not an angle that you choose to put in. Very often people will measure these to the vertical just because it feels right. Well, that's you can't do that. It's measured from the horizontal. And let's say that is known to be um, 10 degrees. And I want to know the height of the tower. How high is the tower? OK. Well, so this isn't one just one right triangle, but it's not too hard because it breaks up into two right triangles. This horizontal that we use to refer the angle of uh, elevation and depression to breaks it up into two right triangles. And so we could call this um, like y and this x, and then it's two right triangle problems separately, and we'll be able to, to figure those out. OK. So. Let me switch over to the pretty printing. And so in that one right triangle, we've got y divided by 400 equals the tan, because that's opposite over adjacent, of 28 degrees. And in the other right triangle, we've got x also over 400 equals tan of 10 degrees. OK. And so that's going to allow us to solve. Now let's flip back just so you can look. So opposite over adjacent, and then opposite over adjacent again, x over 400 and y over 400. OK. And let's go back. OK. So we know that uh, we want x plus y. The height of the tower is x plus y. And then solving those equations, we just get 400 tan 28 degrees plus 400 tan 10 degrees. Now, it's really, really important that this is not the same as 400 times tangent of 38 degrees. If we go back to the picture, there is a 38 degree angle here, but it's not in a right triangle. And if you just try to do it all in one fell swoop as h equals tan of 38 degrees times 400, it will be wrong. It will be incorrect. Okay, And so that's definitely important. And then we just need to evaluate that. And we just get 283.21 feet. OK. So that's um, going a little bit beyond the simplest examples. And then in the next video, we'll go significantly beyond that.